All right, my friends, Captain Jason Martin here. I'm going to show you this site, and this is where you get all your freeware. File Hippo. And you get everything on this site for free, and don't even mess with other, you know, sites that give you viruses and bull crap. But... When you're looking for something, like I just did SpyBot Search and Destroy, which I add to everybody's computer, along with all these other ones down here, Malware Bytes, K-Lite Kodak Pack, AVG Antivirus, as long as you know how to set the advanced settings in the AVG free edition of Antivirus, it's just as good as the paid-for edition. It just doesn't come with the... the protection that you need for firewall and Microsoft's already got one built in so you can just leave Microsoft's but if you get the AVG paid for edition you get the firewall in with it anyway whenever you get a program go to spy whatever you put in make sure you click on the one to the right of it that says download latest version don't click on anything else because it may give you some bullshit software that you don't want so let me show you since I need other softwares for people's computers Adobe oh what Adobe see where it says flash player Acrobat reader I need Acrobat Re reader for people so they can view PDFs and this is all for school stuff, so I'm going to hit download and see it's going to come up here in the right hand corner, download latest version. And the only reason I get that is because people need the PDFs for school. I add in Flash Player, but it's going to take me to Flash Player site. So I, I do need Adobe, and see, it just took me to Adobe's website, and it's asking me if I want the McAfee antivirus, hell no. If it asks you if you want Google Chrome when you do the Adobe Flash Player, get Google Chrome and use it as your web browser, because Microsoft built back doors into their Internet Explorer and is hacking into your stuff and keeping copies of all your stuff. I mean, they all do it, so... But at least uh, Google Chrome has ways of blocking them from stealing your information and using it publicly like Facebook has been doing for years. Like I told you, back when I made My Face or My Book... It was for profiling people. I I mean, I'm telling you, it's not what you think it is. They're watching you off your, your Facebook. They're even setting people up off of Facebook. They tried to set me up off of Facebook, and it's funny. It made me laugh. I use people's Facebooks all, time, all the time to turn them in and see them doing illegal crap on their Facebook. See, I'm getting Adobe Acrobat Reader. So I need that. So now I'm going to go back to File Hippo and do Adobe Flash Player. People are listening to music and watching videos online. But how do you record this content so you can enjoy it? Because I need that. Download Flash Player. And it'll take me right back to their site. Download latest version. You love listening to music and watching videos online, but how do you record this content so you can enjoy it time and time? And now up there in the top, you can see it's going to Adobe site. And no, I don't want McAfee.
Oh, and the battery on my mouse just died, but no biggie. Hold on. Let me switch it out. Okay. No, I'm not installing McAfee, what garbage that is. I just want Flash Player for Google Chrome. And you got to get Flash Player for Internet Explorer also if you're using Internet Explorer. And if you're using Firefox, you got to get the one for Firefox. There goes Flash Player. Now I'm going to go back to... Back to File Hippo. And there are, like I said, there are certain programs that I need to install on everybody's computer so they're ready for school. I don't want them to get to school and it says, oh, you need, you know, this program, you need that program. I downloaded K-Lite Kodak Pack. I downloaded AVG Antivirus, Malware Bytes, SpyBot Search and Destroy. There's a free office program. that works with Word and Excel. So you don't have to download Microsoft stuff and you can use the free version. Why pay for Office right there? Free download and it'll let you work with Excel and Word there's so much free software in here and if you just go to the software and don't even download it just go to it and read what it's all about and don't go to the start download like I said if it gives you some kind of bull crap you don't want to do that just read what it's about to see that that one's not not showing so I wouldn't even touch that it's open office open office and I don't know maybe it's not in there but let's see open office free office and see it bringing me back to that same one I don't know if that's the one or not because it's been so long since I've downloaded it but it's normally at openoffice.org OpenOffice.org. There we go. Open Office. And that's the one with the two little birds on it. That's the free office that will allow you to open Microsoft's Word document and Microsoft's Excel document. Hi, my friends. Late.